So today, I'm going to draw the most badass clone ever. So I'm going to do a small drawing of Starkiller, aka Galen Merrick. But before we start, I just wanted to go ahead and tell you that I am a huge, huge Forced Unleash fan. So reacting and drawing to this as well is going to be super fun today. I basically have been playing Forced Unleash since it first came out. I had a Wii at the time, so I played it on that and not the PS3. But I absolutely enjoyed playing on the Forced Unleash app when it first came out years ago. So today, I'm going to be reacting to every single cinematic trailer for the Forced Unleash. So don't go anywhere and let's get right on into it. You have served your purpose well, my apprentice. But I have no further use for you. Oh my god. Darth Vader portrays this young guy countless times in the game. Ah, oh, shit's about to go down. I know this came out 10 years ago, but they were still on top of their cinematics. They look incredible. Oh shit, I remember these guys. They had the shields and they would they could turn you into burn you with fire or um oh shit. Or they could like co cover you in concrete or something. I will not rest. Oh, Vader can't stop me now. If only they if we played this part in the game, that would be so fun to do. Oh my god, Jesus, he's an animal. Oh shit. What the f Holy shit. Just turn those guys into cinder. My god. Oh. I remember this guy. This is the uh the terror walker from the second game. Ah. Uh. Oh my god, I struggled on this boss for so long. I like how Starko is a bit of a mix. He's not good or bad, he's a little bit of both, and he can still use Force Lightning. Got that right. Oh, I remember these. With the Bad Batch um, already out, I wonder if they are going to use Omega's DNA to make this different version of Starkiller. But like, oh man, it's gonna be... We never get the full backstory. Oh, shit. Darth Vader is gonna dominate it. The cinematics are incredible. The visual effects are even better. Where is she? Obey me, or she dies, apprentice. Does it again. 
Oh my god. It's like he does the Thanos snap and turns everyone to dust. It's insane. Huh? She's about to go down again. Death is a natural part uh -huh. of life. We actually get an appearance of Yoda in the second game. Foolishly, you hold to hope for the life you once had. Let go of everything you fear to lose. You must. You think you have a purpose, a destiny. Uncertain and fearful you are. You are but a shadow of your former self. Confused, you have become weak and misguided. Hide not from yourself. Accept the certainty. Confront your fear that all is lost. Will I ever see you again? Ah, uh, Juno's voice. Ah, uh, I really wish we got a um, a net, um, the third installment of Star Killer. It would have been so fun to play. Uh, he's um, he's on Cato Nemoidia, and uh, he was in the second game. He's facing the, the big monster. I mean, he's right here. Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, this thing right here. This is the Gorog. We don't ever see a second appearance of what this thing is, just in this game. Ah! I'm telling you, this shit's getting real. Uncertain your future is. Find yourself. You. Mouse. Can't believe that him took down a creature this big. It's insane. Oh. Whoa. Oh, I remember this. This was the um. If Star Killer chose the dark side at the very end of the second game, this is what would have happened. I don't like that they made these alternative realities of Starkiller being bad. When I told you the cloning process had not been perfected. It's interesting to see how it would have went down, but it just it just shows that there's no hope and that it just this happens. You have faced your final test. What is thy bidding, my master? Take his star fighter. Scour the far reaches of the galaxy, find the last of the rebels, and destroy them. As you wish. Hmm. I kind of edited this a little bit. Not the same how, same sound. That was pretty freaking amazing. I mean, I loved, uh, the cinematics are always going to be the best. Oh my God. Like I am speechless right now. Like, I haven't seen these trailers in years, and just coming back to them just refreshes so much of me playing the game. Like, oh my god. If you have not played the game already, I highly consider at least going and visiting visiting it, even just looking through the cutscenes. Like, they're so incredible. Oh my god. Like, oh. I'm just bummed out that they did not make a third installment for the game. It would have been so fun to play. But without further ado... Let's get straight on into the drawing.
So I hope you guys enjoyed this drawing of Starkiller. But if you want to see me draw more Star Wars content like this in the future, let me know in the comments down below. But let me tell you what I'm going to do for my next video. So my next video is going to be a drawing of Assassin's Creed. That's right, Assassin's Creed. So I'm going to put a poll on my Instagram for Assassin's Creed, and it's going to be between two games. Are you ready? So it's going to be between Assassin's Creed Origins or Assassin's Creed Syndicate. So make sure to go over to my Instagram and vote your favorite. But besides that, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you later.